And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one, my goodness, so much to look forward to. It is FC Copenhagen facing Borussia Dortmund. Yes, cheers, Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in they're the underdogs, but if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. for the home side well it can be seen as a very defensive shape but if they have good athletes in midfield which they have who are ready to break forward as soon as possession is won they can still pose a big threat today And here's the 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Rafael Guerrero starts with Thomas Meunier as fullbacks. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. It's the opening match day, Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. This attack looks highly promising. And a body in the way. Well, he could give it away. And foul it is then. Trolava, Cornelius has it, losing possession a bit easily, Doniel Malin, can he play it in, not away completely, and I think the threat has been averted, well that's how to beat your opponent, superb block, He's got to score! Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And played short. Useful ball to the near post. But goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. Decent position for Dortmund to be in. And coolly done despite the mounting pressure. Niklas Zule. Nico Schlotterbeck. Royce with others close by. A really top-notch piece of defending. Falk.
Marco Reus. Daniel Malin. And Reus getting higher up the pitch as the attack continues. Oh, couldn't beat the goalkeeper. Can they forge ahead? And this is Reus. Bellingham! And he couldn't bag the first goal of the contest. Well, I can't believe he's missed the target there. That's a poor finish. Klasson. Really good attacking play. But no damage done, that's the main thing. Jude Bellingham. The ball with Marco Royce. And a shot from some way out. And good work to deny the chance. Now, how about the short corner? Gives it a go! He can't hold on to it! Finally gathered by the keeper. Well, that's a really good recovery. He had to be smart there. Christiansen. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Moving into the advanced position. Opportunity it is. Oh, that was begging to be put home, but the goalkeeper has it. Price. Slipshod passing. And he might be through here. Pivotal moment defensively. Well, he could run onto it here. Giving it a try. And closed down straight away. A chance now with the corner. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Can he deliver it with accuracy? So the whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. Well, Marco Reis can be devastating, but not so much in this game, Stuart. Well, the touch map tells us everything. He just hasn't been able to get on the ball in dangerous positions. Yes, he's been well marked, but he has to do a lot more to find space, I think. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Well, Dortmund have it back now. Marco Reus. Klasson. And teammates around him. Can he take advantage? Off the post and back in play. On a time for composure on the ball. Well, they won't come closer than that, but they are creating chances and surely a goal is coming. Anthony Modest. Malen with it. And he's in. Oh, that's a fine save.
fired over by Guerrero. Not away completely. Guerrero. And he could be in proper trouble here. And thumped away. No well, foul play, says the referee. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. And this is Royce, regained possession. Could be a chance to break here. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? They might be able to get in now. And the cross smuggled away. And a long way out. And the keeper was up to the task. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. And delivered by Rafael Guerrero. Well, that is going to go down as an own goal by the keeper. Well, here's the replay, and he's unlucky. He didn't know too much about that, but it's an own goal, I'm afraid. Well, an own goal that has left them trailing and flailing. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Kocholava. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Well, very nearly at full time, and it's Dortmund with a marginal advantage in this one. Stewart, what have you made of their performance? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack, and of course they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. Özcan working really well as a team to regain possession. Falk. Klasson. On the attack in the closing phase. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Now can they counter clinically? Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Mohamed Darami. He has time to play it over. Well, I think the fans are doing everything they can to get their team back into this. But can they find that moment of inspiration and get an equaliser? Rice. Not totalling up all the stoppages. We'll have two additional minutes. Firing is in. Well, four marks to him for giving it a try from that tight angle. Well, he took everybody by surprise there. That was a really decent attempt. Well, sensible refereeing, you might say. Now he goes back and hands out the yellow card, Stuart. Yeah, that's very good. He let the play continue and then came back for the earlier challenge. And Dortmund will go to the bench.
And there goes the final whistle. A home defeat to begin the group stage. And they're going to have to make up for this in future games. Yeah, they'll be disappointed. It's an uphill battle if you don't get anything from your opening game. It really comes down to how they bounce back now. Vital we see a better performance next time out.